Hey, hey loves, welcome back. So today we're going to be doing a power hour, which I'm so excited about because I like to do these at least a few times during the week. And sometimes, especially around this time of year, one hour is all that we have. <laughs> so I'm actually starting off by making a list, which I typically don't do, but I really had a few things that were priority and I wanted to make sure that they got done. So here's the list that I'm writing out. And I will tell you that my microwave is definitely a priority on that and you'll see why in just a minute. But this is also a collaboration with my sweet friend Lynn from Lynn Purposeful Joy, who is so sweet. She's probably one of the most supportive YouTube mamas that I've met. She's just absolutely amazing. She's so close to 10,000 subscribers. So please let's help get her to 10,000. If you love my channel, I know that you will love hers. So make sure to head on over and let her know that I sent you. So you can see here that it is 1238 and I'm giving myself one hour to get those items on the list done. Of course, I have to start off by lighting some candles because I feel like if it smells better, it just is cleaner. <laughs> so let's get started. So I am gonna be hand washing these all clad pans um, because I did get some new pans for the holidays and I feel like if I put them in the dishwasher, it kind of messes them up. So something that I've been making sure to do is hand wash all of the pans and then anything else that I think is delicate um, like this electric um, water boiler is also something that I will hand wash. So if you look to where the candle is, you'll notice some black there. I actually didn't notice it until I started wiping down um, the quartz in the back. And I guess because my candle was there, it just left that like residue on there. And so I noticed that the residue was um, like kind of floated upwards. So you'll notice that I'm actually cleaning all of this. I'm using the barkeeper's friend here, but to be honest, it didn't get everything off. So I am gonna have to get a Mr. Clean um, sponge and wipe it down. I actually ran out, but you can see there in that corner, it's just not 100% clean. So I'm kind of disappointed, but I'm definitely not gonna be putting my candle there again. 
So here you can see why the microwave was on my list as a priority. To be honest, because it's so deep, I have to get a step stool, and even then I struggle like with reaching in. Um, I don't know, it, it's just, I guess, it's really deep in inset uh, microwave. So I do struggle, so to be honest, it's one of the last things that I will prioritize as far as getting cleaned. I know that's gross, but you know, here I am cleaning everything down and I'm actually using Awesome, um, which is a degreaser from the dollar store. This is something I feel like that works the best, especially on the microwave and all of the, the stuff that just kind of gets caked on. And you'll see in just a minute how clean everything comes out. But all I do is spray it on, let it sit for a couple minutes, and then it just comes right off. So in my bathroom, I was using the all-purpose spray from Melaleuca to clean my counters and my sinks. And then I was using the um, glass cleaner from Melaleuca as well as the tub and tile cleaner uh, to clean my tub that you'll see in just a minute. But I love the product so far. Um, the smell is amazing. Um, and I've been basically just keeping them all here in my bathroom. So this is where I've been using them the most. So the last thing that I'm gonna go ahead and do is vacuum up the bathroom. Uh, again, this is something that I definitely have to do regularly um, just because a lot of my hair gets in there. I am taking the bath mats to the laundry room to get washed, but you can see that it was a little bit over on my time and I still have my laundry to put away. It is folded in there. My bed did not get made and unfortunately it didn't get made for that whole day because I just didn't see the point at this time <laughs> of day to make it. So some things are just better left undone right um, but I am so happy that I did get my master bathroom cleaned as well as the microwave and just a few other things on the checklist so um, that's it for this particular video I hope that you guys enjoyed I hope that it motivated you to take one hour out of your day and just prioritize some things on your to-do list and get them done and if you 
don't get a chance to finish things, that is okay. The point of a power hour is just to try and do as much as you can within that hour. As always, I appreciate you guys. Thank you guys so much. Please make sure to head on over to Lynn's channel. Let her know that I sent you. Make sure to get that extra motivation by watching her power hour. And I will see you guys in the next one. Down town.